Hi everybody, Dan here with No Games for Old Men. Welcome back to Banishers. We're headed toward God's Acre to investigate a potential haunting situation. The Harrow's Haven Cobbler, not Haven, Harrow's Hamlet Cobbler, Caleb Watson. He's got something going on with him. His wife and brother died in a fire. And there is some... Some mystery about that fire. Was it intentional? God's Acre. God's Acre. Oh boy. Oh, I see something. Yonder. And I see some wisps. Alright, so we've got a burial ground. Well, I mean, this is a cemetery, but look at this. Holy Toledo. This is, um, something, again, tore this ground apart. And the bridge appears to be, yeah, the bridge is up and inaccessible, and I don't see any weak points in the rope or anything that I can shoot to bring it down. Let's take a look at this. Oh boy, that's something else. That's a way to go. Um, Alright, so I guess we're going up this little cliff face here. what's in this little area here first, if anything. Okay, just a, just a nice little picnic spot, I guess. Well, we're committed now. Can't get back up that way. This is Here more than. We are. Let us find the graves of Alexander and Ruth, and whatever got Kate up acting so strange. Yeah, this is more than just a canyon forming. I mean, this is the earth was rent apart here. Something calamitous. Hey, maybe you've got a better... Someone's been doing some undertaking. <laughs> In New Eden, there's much to be done. Okay. Okay, we got some wisps... fluttering about down there. And over here. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh 
Okay, I'll, I guess I'll go with him. I, I meant to take out the scythe guy, but... Okay, he's done. Piss off! Oh, we got more. Oh, orbs. Watch out. Spectre position. Where? No! Ha! Whoop! Ooh, he vanished. Sneaky. Alrighty. Three robbers. Yes. But what exactly were they stealing? I mean, this is suspicious because Caleb's got a box of bones in his backyard. Over there, make sure that I've explored all of this area thoroughly first. Like, whatever this is, of course, it's on the other side. Oh, we got a path up there, too. How big is this area? Oh, wow, it's quite extensive. Okay. Ruth Watson. There's another grave beneath it. What are you looking at? Over there? Okay, let's see. Oh, here she is. Okay. Another grave beneath it? Beneath. Like, down there? Uh. Oh, God. It's just leaving corpses out. Come on, grave robbers. Clean up after yourselves. Marcin left! I guess that was a pretty good use of Banish there, huh? Got rid of that guy right away. If Undertakers did this, they should find other work. Yeah, they're messy. I doubt there's a job on Earth that suits whatever did this. And very disrespectful of the dead. Speaking of which, I'm gonna rob from this coffin. Jeez. Oh! There's a rabbit attached to this grave cross. Decoys to distract wayward specters. Rudimentary. Someone's had a little training. Is it lamentation? Governor Haskell's had him making all the ghost wards. Okay, something over here. It is Alexander. Here did lie Alexander Watson. Did Caleb take their bodies? Someone did. And he's at the top of my list. Well, they made quite the mess. Perhaps the decoys make sure it's the way. Follow the path. Don't get too close. I'll try. Okay.
this way. More of them. Yep. That's what I was talking about when I said don't get too close. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I get you. I get you. I'm picking up what you're throwing down, but, uh, you know, XP. How else am I going to practice? Oh. Good, good, good. We need lots of that. Oh, darn it. I didn't see that one until it was too late. I can help. I think I, I, think I got this. Is there another one? Nope. Okay. Uh-oh. We're about to We're gonna have a doggy fight, I think. There's another one. I mean, that one actually has something to pick up, so. Can't pass that up. Demonology. I should have known. Oh, look at that. Someone's got a summoning circle or something down there. Let's go ahead and drop this rope down. Oh! Wait. Hang on. It's already down. I thought this was the... Ooh. Well. I gotta check it out. I gotta see what's here. Hearing that. Oh, and we've got this. See? See, guys? You gotta look at every corner. Every corner. Six crisp moss. Cash and thread. And then whatever's through here. Ah, it is a path where we want to go in the first place. Ta-da! The Desolate Harvester. This fella again. Oh, hello! He's persistent. I'll grant him that. Well, let's banish. Blasted pest! Bloody wee shite, don't you? I totally missed that. It's up to no good. Oh, birds. All right. Darn it. You got me. They never learn, do they? Oh, no. I rolled right into that. Turns into a 
before he possesses something. Okay, good, got him. Oh, I don't mean to do that. Oh, I didn't. That was dumb. I didn't mean to do that at all. Wow, she's not doing any damage to this guy. Hardly any. I'll get you eventually. Nice. Oh. Oops. Did that way too early. <laughs> calm down, calm down. That was not worth it! That was not worth it to get that fourth strike in there so I could get Entea to take a swing at him. Alright, we'll just do two. Oh, you... They never learn, do they? Uh, that means we got a new one. Let's get him, see if we can get some- Oh boy! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. None of this is good. Got another trick up your sleeve. Oh, load. Oh no! No, not on him! Oh! Stay down! I did not mean to hit A there. Shucks. Oh well. Oh well. It happens. Oh, I don't like this. Crows answer its call. Again? Uh oh. <laughs> Get the hell out of there. Banish. Oh no, banish, 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 banish. Oh. Try that. Oh, I hate those things. Jeez. Wasn't your first, won't be your last. Aye. Thank you. Boy. He was very slow to banish there. All right, what did we get? We got vi Vigor, Vigor Mortis, Outburst, Area of Effect Size is increased by 70%. Whoa. Whoa, that's pretty nice. What, what am I, okay, Manifestation Damage increased by 100%. <sighs> oh, man, that one hurts. That one hurts. Um, let's see. Manifestation Damage is higher. All right, what do we need to upgrade it? We need a bunch of ghastly concretion, which we don't have, so we're gonna hang on to this for Shrines now. Shrines now? With bones? It's like Lady Blackwood's food war around here. Old emotions are trapped here. There's a couple. Parchment. An aged parchment, smudged and discolored, on which is written the annotated instructions for the incantation of the Lesser Palingenesis, a powerful resurrection ritual. What is that? It's a chant. Got some surgeon snips there, too. I don't want to step into this, but I guess I have to. Whoa! Who that fella? You nasty, aren't you? Nasty, yes. But also shoddy. It's very poor work. 
It looks like a butchered version of the ritual of lesser palingenesis. The ritual of... that ritual? The one that brings someone back? That ritual? Yes, that ritual. Hark for Echoes. Is that what I'm doing? Doing a hearkening. Easy for you to say. As flesh unto verb, as verb unto heart, as heart unto flesh. So who's... death's knot is unsevered, Galatas. and I shall cut it. Alexander. Caleb Watson invoked a ghost without a body for it to inhabit, so it took his. Caleb is no longer Caleb. Yup. Ha ha. Is he still in there too? He used pieces of his wife and also of his brother. Ruth, Alexander, Caleb, could be any combination of them in there. Let's go find out which. So, when we're... When we are hearing Caleb saying in a kind of a calmer, gentler voice, this is wrong, this is wrong, I wonder if that's Caleb himself, or perhaps Ruth. Well. Oh, there's our ship again that we can't figure out how to get up into the <laughs> captain's quarters. I really hope that we can figure that out at some point. I'm hoping something will take us there and uh, solve that riddle for us because that's uh, very disappointing. Disappointed in myself that I haven't been able to figure it out. So I'm, I'm hoping that it's just not something that I can do yet. And that it's not me failing to execute something or recognize a riddle. Alrighty, I saw plants that I can collect over here. There we are, some crisp moss. Okay, now I think, yeah, we can head back to Caleb, or whomever he is. What is this? Oh, there's a shelter over here. Ooh. Do I want to go do that? Before I get to Caleb? Because then I can kind of bounce back and forth between the two. This is a... a banner for, well, point of interest. Let's... Drop the, the bridge first. I'm thinking this point of interest is going to be... It's going to be whatever those wisps are. Well, maybe not. Well. Let's quit speculating and actually find out. Hey? How's about that? Okay, well, first we drop the gate. Just in case i got to make a hasty retreat. Not yet. Reinforcements! Oh, there he is. Oh, 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 heck no. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. Unacceptable. Don't just stand there. Move! 
Oh, it's a... One of the... Oh, we got another... Another ranged... Okay, first I gotta get rid of these. They never learn, do they? Okay, now... Oh, there's another one. No! Oh. You. Die. Get rid of these guys before they can inhabit something. Ooh. Hit me. Nice. Oop, good. Oop! Oh, I did not dodge far enough away from that. Okay, that was marginally successful. Really? Can't hop over that? All right. All right, we now have free movement in and out of God's Acre Cemetery. So let's head over here and see what this point of interest is. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Also a house here. Let's check this out. Oh, I see a hanging barrel over there too. Hmm. Missed it. Oh, I see that. Do we have a wooden figurine somewhere? In this area? that I did not see the glow. It's the glow that I saw from the entrance. All right, so that is two farmer figurines. We've got one more, and then we've got to find the... the cursed chest. Okay, well, I'm glad I took this little detour to come over here. Excellent. I need as much ghastly concretion as I can get. Okay, here is... Here is this. So I'll interact with it so it hops up on the map. Me the Does it cost? But I still need one... Perform ritual. Do I have enough? No, I only have two. You need three. Yeah, insufficient resources. Okay. So, we'll keep our eyes open for anything else glowing purple. So now from here, we do a little map check. Can't get down here yet. Although if I head this way, I could get over here. Make a 
left here. Oh, there we go. This has to be it. Nice. All right, well, so I don't forget, let's go and claim that immediately. See what kind of gear we get for it. I command you to leave now. What'd he get? What'd he get? What'd he get? What'd he get? Protective charm. This is... Damage dealt by Antea increased by 60% against full health enemies. I mean, that's like a one-punch benefit. Much higher wrath than what I have right now. The benefit of that doesn't seem all that great, unless... I guess if you're focusing mostly on red as your primary combatant and not really switching to Antea very often, that might be a good one to have to use because then you can switch to her real quick, take that one punch, get the 60% bonus, and then jump back to red, I suppose. That's an option. All right, we've got the old mill. Old mill pastures. That is where Alexander's grave is. His exhumed coffin. The dark woods. We've got a path to the dark woods from here. Oh, through here probably. Yeah, wow, it, it would take a long way. Long way to get there. Uh, so let's... We are close now, so let's make a right. We'll come up here and unlock that. Although I am curious to know what's that way. <laughs> but we gotta make a choice. Yeah, don't slip. A little game starter there. <laughs> Harrow's pastures discovered. I see this. We'll have to go around, though, to get it. And if we go to the farmhouse... There. Oh, we've got some enemies. Oh, there's another thing hanging there. I just missed. 100%. There we go. Alright, we'll grab that. We'll battle these fools. Excellent. So 
a well-timed banish. All right, let's grab this, unlock this first, because there's a whole reason I came over here before we start exploring the pastures here, because there's actually seems to be quite a bit going on over here. Oh, shelter with a damp and itchy straw bed. Nice. Just how I like it. Yeah. Okay, so now, from here, we can explore the pastures and then have a quick way to get back to the Harrow's Hamlet to confront Caleb next episode. First, I want to see if I can upgrade anything. I do have some available here. We can upgrade our brooch. Get that. Ooh, two of three is Scourge Accretion. Oh, that's our red goddess. And then from there, nope, we're going to use two of those three Scourge Accretions, so we'll need three more, or two more. But let's go ahead and upgrade it. And then, let's see, Bane Ring, do we have any rings that we can upgrade? Eh, we can do that one. Nest Silt is pretty, pretty low on that, so I don't think I want to do that. Red's first Bane Ring. Aww. Scourge Accretion? No, I'm not going to use that. Okay, what about the Banisher outfit, though? The Banisher clothes that we just picked up. Soul Shard, yeah. Plentiful resources there. So let's go ahead and get that upgraded. And now we're locked out because we need two gems. We're full on decoctions, and we don't have any points to spend on evolution. So let's go ahead and back out of here and do a little bit of exploration of the pasture here. I saw, I think, a haunting ground. Concealed. Okay, whatever it was, it's over here. Somewhere. I feel something close. There it is. Great, more ghastly concretion. And what is that little town over there? Oh, something completely new. All right. Well, let's head down this way. I think this is I think this is what I was seeing. Uh, just skirting the edge of the fence line here and make sure there's nothing to pick up. Nothing's concealed. Again? Another pretty fresh body. I mean, like, fairly fresh. Not that the body itself is pretty. She might have been. I don't know. I'm not going to look that closely because I'm not a creep. Oh, yep, okay. Oh, it's uh, one of the... One of the unendings. Okay, get that loaded, because we're about to have a fight. What is luck in here? Time to work, Banisher to work, Banish. Another fresh corpse. This is a bad place to be. Wait a minute, is that a... Oh, 
It looked like one of the altars. I was wondering how I was going to get up there, but no. Alright guys, what do you think? Should we do it? Of course. We'll give it one try. Swarming specters. Force them to appear with the right words of power. Ready and waiting. Oh wait, no, no, no. We're supposed to be switching Dante here. What happened? Was a bad dodge. Oh, I missed. <laughs> I was trying to hit him so I could take out the dogs while. Ooh, boy, okay, that three hit combo. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. More leap damage. Alright, so we need to be using Antea's leap, but. Of that at the moment. Man. Wow, that took him out completely. Nice. I have another insight. Blarg. Oh, that dude just appeared. Oh no, he's a gunner too. All right, we gotta banish him. Why do I get the feeling that No! Get away! Oh my Lanta, I am completely surrounded. Reinforcements! See another ranged oh there he is. Oh, 
another one. Okay. No. The big one's a ranged guy. Nice. So, we're just going to keep our distance until Leap keeps refreshing. Nice. Okay, now it's just me and this guy. all used up. Got some nest silt, ghastly concretion, awesome. Wow, lots of loot around here to be had. Okay. Very nice. Now, we could do it again, but we need to go c confront Caleb and find out what the heck is going on with him and his wife and his brother. The wicked games they're playing. And we will do that next episode. I'm going to head over to the farmhouse, the abandoned farmhouse here, and I'm going to use the... Oh, we got an... Look at, the, look at this. Look at these guys. Guarding the road. All right. But we're going to use the fast travel option. Oh, hold on. I see something glowing in here. Something has me. Wards. Where are the wards? Uh oh. That was a miss. Oh, oh my god, another one. What is going on here? I should have. Uh... Oh, there's two of them. Incoming. Uh oh. Alright, calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Guys, I was trying to end the episode. Oh no! trying to end the episode, and y'all are being really, really rude about it. Oh, gosh. I don't have access to Antea at all. Oh, jeez. Where's the ghost board? Is it around? Oh, no! Wow! Okay, I'm looking for the ghost word. Looking for the ghost word. Where is it? I need it. I'm right here, you know. I I mean, but not when I need you. Actually, there we go. We just drew these guys out. Okay. 
There we go. Nice. Away with you. Unfortunately, they drew me back into the area that has. Go Ooh. Holy Toledo! Let's uh. Just die. Put vanish on this guy. All right, let's let's back up. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Although minimally useful. Ooh. Okay, all right. Yeah, we're not benefiting from that more leap damage condition. That could be an interesting one-two punch. Do impact and then outburst immediately, because then you can you've got time to fully charge it up so you get the maximum damage. I saw something in here. Yeah, yeah, we've got we've got a witchy box. Huh? How do I get in here? Did I walk right past the door? Yes. Ha! <laughs> Idiot. This is locked from the inside. Okay. So... Yeah, there we go. Oh, hang on. Uh-oh. I can't get a clear shot. Maybe from here. About from down here. Oh, I feel like I can see it, but then when you aim, it changes your angle. So now I can't see it. Hmm. Um. Ooh, maybe I can get into it from underneath. There's all kinds of stuff. Okay, nope, I can't. I gotta focus. Gotta focus. Let's get in there. I'm grab these. Since we are right here, it's not a big detour. But then we go blammo. There we go. Okay, good. Nice. Okay, now I'm going to end the episode. <laughs>
10 minutes later after I was trying to. All right, folks, thanks for joining me for this episode of Banishers. I'll see you next time. Have a great day. Thank you.